What's up, everybody? Welcome to Podcast Now Plus. I'm Alex, and in this video, I want to talk about the Super Mario Bros. movie. Talk about if it could reach a billion dollars. Some of my quick thoughts. I mean, the movie comes out this upcoming week. I am super, super excited. My daughter is honestly super, super excited. And that's a big part of this in terms of the box office predictions. Can it reach a billion dollars? I think it can. Now, the projections don't really show that I think it's going to do it if you just go based off the projections. Projections, right? So right now it's looking at maybe it can hit a hundred million dollars domestically. Now I don't know what you want to say for international, but if it opens at a hundred million domestically, you imagine that kind of you know tails off. Maybe it reaches like a 225, 250 kind of situation domestically. That wouldn't be enough, right? Now, if you're comparing it to things like Sonic and stuff, I think this movie, okay, this Super Mario Bros. movie is going to be one of the biggest video game, you know, adaptation movies of all time it's actually shocking when you see i think the popularity of the sonic films and how good they are because they really are so good but they really i mean they've made a lot of money but they haven't made like over the moon we haven't seen like the seven eight nine hundred million dollar you know goals or benchmarks reached by sonic right and i want to bring that up because i go back and forth when this movie really started to get going over the last groupings of, of trailers and all of just how amazing this movie looks i really thought i really bought into the idea that can this movie make a billion dollars yes it can but then you think okay well these movies just they don't do it right these video game movies do not get to a billion dollars but again, I go back and forth because while no movie has really done it or gotten even relatively close, this movie, like Mario, just kind of transcends everything, doesn't it? I, I really believe that. Like, you know, when you make an Uncharted movie or even Sonic, Sonic is such a big IP, but Mario, can you really beat Mario? I really don't think you can. And then you do it animated. So you immediately, like, yes, you may have the issues with the voice, and we'll see how Chris Pratt and, and Charlie Day do as the voices. But you have the visuals that you don't even have to worry about making it live action and going down that probably pathetic road. Instead, it's all animated. It looks so good. And you're going to be targeting everybody. Like like I said, my like I don't even know if I'm that big of a Mario fan. I like Mario, Smash Bros, Mario Kart is a, a personal favorite. And even my daughter, like she plays the Switch and she watches TV and all that kind of stuff. I wouldn't say Mario is in like her top, but I showed her the very first trailer that they made and she was literally blown away. So I, I think, and she's nine. So I mean, I think this is going to go after kids in that range, teenagers, full-blown adults like I think it's gonna target literally everybody I think it's gonna make a lot of money if I were to give a prediction and I do believe that's what this video is all about man it's tough because I do think if this movie opens and it just does so tremendously well right like word of mouth I think that's probably gonna be the make or break because I do think this movie like if it made say 200 million in the first weekend right or first full week with domestic and then also international National, which it could probably even make more. I, I wouldn't be surprised if it made like a 225 or 250 across the entire world in the first uh, first opening week. That's a lot of money, and there is a path, I believe, from say a quarter mark of a billion to then a billion. You know, you got 75 percent. Now that is a lot. That is a lot to make up. Normally, you do a lot of it in the beginning, and then it kind of trails off. But word of mouth is a real thing. I think if it's such positive reception, I think this movie kind of gets a boost. It's really going to be all about how it does from week one to two. Does it drop 70%? Does it drop like 30 or 40%? Oftentimes, well, with these animated movies, I should say, right? The, the success stories, the ones that do really well, there is not that big of a drop. So, you know, movies that drop 30, 40, 50% from week one to week two, that is a tremendous success. That That's saying really, really good things about that film. So if this movie drops like 45%, I think it's got a shot, but I probably imagine this movie ends up in that like 600 to 800 million range. I think that's probably where it goes, which is still, I think, phenomenal. And like I said, I'm really excited to see this movie. I'll be reviewing the movie when I say I think we're seeing it on Wednesday. So Wednesday night on the channel, I'll try to do a review on this film. Okay, so let me know what you guys think. Think. Are you excited? How much money do you think it's going to make in the box office? Let me know. Make sure you're all subscribed, bell icon turned on, and I hope to see you all on the next one.